dozens and dozens of people all at the Green Bay Area Public School Board meeting for the same reason on Monday night. Every time I have a sliver of hope that you guys would do the right thing, it keeps coming down and getting shattered. Please do the right thing now. Reinstate Dr. Tiller. Nine days after the Green Bay Board of Education unanimously accepted Claude Tiller Jr.'s resignation, his supporters are still advocating for his reinstatement, filling up the boardroom to the point where it was standing room only for those who didn't come early enough. You, the Board of Education, are at the crossroads. Will you choose the well-trodden path of indifference, or will you seize this moment to stand up against racism to celebrate the rich diversity of our student body. Students spent more time out there walking around, talking to teachers. Nobody has really talked about the teachers here, but what is about the chilling effect on them if they speak out? Tiller Jr. supporters upset that the Board of Education did not publicly support the former superintendent after placing him on administrative leave, saying they should have waited until after the video recording of the comments he made on the Atlanta-based radio station got released to the public before deciding whether to accept his resignation. Many of his supporters said Tiller Jr. was the first superintendent in the district to listen to their concerns. The Board of Education saying in part in a statement, quote, we are committed to the academic goals developed by Dr. Tiller and the leadership team, which accelerate learning for our students who are in need of the greatest support. As a board, we are committed to doing the hard work that is needed to move our district forward. For the first time on Monday night, we heard the impact that Claude Tiller Jr. had on the students in the district from the students themselves. When Dr. Tiller came into Preble High School, I had the honor to shake his hand and hear his story. I was so delighted and happy to see someone that looks just like me in power. So I believe personally that he should be reinstated because what he said, although maybe harsh, it was not wrong. In Green Bay, Paul Stino, Local 5 News. More upheaval for Green Bay schools. The only Native American representative on the board resigned. Laura Leighton Warren was appointed to fill a vacant seat in 2021 and was re-elected the following year to serve until 2025. Officials say they plan to review the timeline and process to appoint a new board member and eventually pick a new member through a spring election.